yeah, it was a bit hard to take. It was a hard pill to swallow, especially like losing a grand final. And, you know, two days later, kind of having that conversation was a bit tough. And Is that yeah. timing weird? Rugby league is a business yeah, at the end yeah, of the day. Yeah. And, you know, you, you now know that. And I found that out about seven times. But um, <laughs> it, it is what it is, right? And yeah. you just got to take it on the chin. Yeah. And you obviously did and moved on. So I obviously had some time to kind of, you know, reflect and think about that situation. And um, again, like you said, it is a business at the end of the day. Uh, I was there for pretty much a quarter of my life. So I, re I really grew up at that club. I went through the highs and lows and you know, I'm, I'm an emotional person. Like I get really emotionally attached to things and I'm pretty loyal, I like to think, with my mates or especially with a club that I ever, or whoever I play for.